How to put images next to each other using card. Hey everyone, welcome. I hope you're all doing great. In this video, I will show you exactly how to... Basically, in card, you can't really put images right next to each other. It's going to be one at the top, one at the bottom, and so on. But we can actually go ahead and do it. And I'll show you exactly how to do so. It could be two pictures or three, uh, or even more, I believe. So we can just go ahead and do that right now. I'm just going to start out with a blank page here. And you can see now uh, that we can just add an image by clicking on the uh, plus icon, which is the add an element option. And I'm just going to show you, I'm just going to add an image here. And if you try to add another image right next to it, it's not going to work. Um, as you can see, you can try to drag it up here. It's not really going to work. Uh, it can either be just above it or below it. Uh, but what we can do is just delete those and instead of actually just adding the images right away uh, what we can do is go ahead and click on the add element and we would want to use a container now a container is going to be a uh, empty box you could say that you can add elements to but what's special about a container is that you can actually split it uh, into multiple columns so that you can actually have it uh, more than just one big box is going to be uh, left right or even three pieces it's, it, i'm just i'm just going to show you exactly how to do it so let's just go ahead and add a container here you can move it uh, wherever you want if you would like it to be on the top of the site or at the bottom here which i'm going to do uh, and you can just see that it's going to look like this it's just one strip uh box whatever you want to call it and it's going to be just one piece now what what we need to do is just go to the type of the actual uh, container click on that and change it to be columns so in here we can actually go ahead and select uh you can see we have the left column and we have the right column here and we can add even more columns so if you want to have three and I believe you can just go ahead and add even more. I'm not sure how many more you can actually add. I usually just go for the two or three maximum. Uh, because sometimes the four doesn't really look that great. Or at least five wouldn't really look that good. It really depends on how you want to design it. Anyways, let's just stick with two here. So you should have two different columns here. And you can just go ahead and add the images to them. Uh, this way we can have an image to the left and we can also have an image to the right. And not only that, but we can actually adjust them respectively. So we can adjust the left one so that it is uh, less than the other one and so on. So right now it's 50-50 when it, when it comes to the width uh, and also the alignment and stuff. So you can just go ahead and adjust it to your liking. But how do we actually add the images to these two? It's very simple. Just go ahead and add... Um, the image uh, right here so let me just add one let me just add another uh, and we can just move it upwards i don't want it to be like that okay so we have these two right now and we can just go ahead and drag and drop them to these columns and we can see now we have these two images right next to each other now and again I, as i said if you want to add even more you can just go ahead and click on add and you have the ability to add even more pictures right next to each other. And this is pretty much how to add images next to each other using card. Hopefully you found this video to be helpful and thanks for watching.